My video today is going to show you how to take names that are in two separate columns, in this case column A and column B, and put them as one, as you see here, into column C. Um, so what you need to do, um, obviously, um, presuming your spreadsheet is already set up with your names in column A and column B, um, in column C here, we're going to add in, um, you can see I have the formula in already, equals A2, and sign, parentheses, space, parentheses, and B2. And what's going to happen then, um, if you do control C, um, you have a little dashing lines to indicate that you're copying that formula. You're going to copy it down your entire range of cells that you want to do the same thing with. And you can see then um, what was A2 and B2 before is now A3 and B3 and so on and so forth. Um, you can see for example purposes I left a couple of these cells blank um, presuming there was no last name in order to do that. Um, and you can see it still pulls everything over um, perfectly so now we have first and last name all in one cell. Now I'm going to show you if we go through here now and we delete these Ooh, now we have an error message. Um, so what we need to do then, um, in order to keep these as constants, so once we delete out columns A and columns B, um, that we have our names yet as we need them. So highlight your entire range, right click, copy, come over to your first cell in a blank um, column, right click, paste special, and then you want to paste only your values. Um, you don't want to paste your formulas because it's going to put you back in the same situation we just saw before where all of a sudden now you don't have your names anymore. So we're going to go ahead, we're going to click OK here, um, and then as you can see now it only says Johnny Depp. Um, it does not say um, anything in the formula bar. So if we delete, let's just delete these out for purposes. Um, if you only do it with the formula, that's what you have as a result in column A. Um, however, once we do the paste special as I just did here, um, you have everything in there um, and you have no problems whatsoever. So that's just a quick little tip to help you um, condense um, into one column and then to keep that consistent so that you have the ability to have the data saved without your formulas once your original um, destination cells are deleted. Let me know if you have any questions.